everybody. Uh, my name is Ivan and I'm uh, a physical education teacher, a gym teacher here in Campbell School. And I would like to show you some exercises that uh, we're doing here with students. And here are my helpers, my sons, that are going to help me to show you uh, how we exercise. Uh, Dima and Johnny, say hi. Okay, so uh, exercise is really important in now, now when we have our extended time to, to spend home. And, and the importance, first of all, because we have to be active, we have to engage our muscles, to, we have to burn our calories, we have to be actively engaged in their, um, uh, what we're doing. And the second thing is that we should keep practicing the skills that are really important, like running, jumping, hopping, uh, pushing, pulling, throwing a ball, right? Some of our students are uh, very good with the skills, some are still learning them, some are, are very in the very beginning. Uh, and this, another thing why, why we should do exercises, because all of a sudden we have lots of time right now, right? Just sitting at home and we should do something with that time. And it's nice time spending being physically active. So I'm planning to do two exercises today to show you. Uh, first is pulling the rope and the second is squatting. For today exercises we will need materials and first thing is uh, cones that we're going to use for marking the space uh, that we can run around. You can also use other materials to mark the space here. Um, we will need um, a hoop or any object that your child can hold to right with you and do squats also uh, for their pulling exercise we will need rope and bucket and we will need some heavy materials to put inside the bucket yeah thank you like this and also we're gonna place in the bucket some things that interest your child well, like a ball um, and under the bucket, we're going to put something that protects, protects the floor from scratches. Okay, let me help. Boop. Like this. Okay, so before we do exercises, um, and by the way, you will be able to see uh, examples of our students doing those exercises here in Campbell School with us. Okay, so... Um, as I said, we're going to do first um, uh, pulling the rope and squatting. But before we do those exercises, I usually start with warming up exercise, right? And what we do is running, okay? So I'm going to set the scene for the running. And uh, what I do, I usually use some kind of markings to, to show where we're going to run. And let's see. And it's really tight space here, and so you make sure that I know. Okay, so let's see. This one, this one. So I marked the space, and we're gonna run around the cones. Uh, when you start do this uh, warming, up, warming up exercise, make sure you create an atmosphere of excitement because it, it helps their prepare your body and mind for, for their physical activity. So guys, what? stand up, look what we're going to do. We're going to run around the cones here, okay? Take it up. You can use any type of tag game or chasing game to engage your children. Okay, so let's do it, guys. Come on, run the cones, come on. Come on, run, 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 follow me. Run the cones, come on, come on, come on. Run, 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 run. Okay, 
so do this exercise for about three, four, five, ten minutes. Depends on the ability of your child. Uh, okay, so let's move this away. Okay. So when we warmed up, we can move to next an exercise, and it is going to be pulling the rope. And for this, you will need here. You will need a rope. Here, a rope that you actually can make a rope out of an old curtain or old sheet. Uh, the length of the rope will depend on the space, kind of space you have. It could be 30 feet, 15 feet. It could be as small as this room. And so next you will need a, a bucket. A bucket. This, a bucket, yes. And I'm gonna attach here. I'm gonna attach the rope to the bucket. I will put different materials first to make it heavier so like this I using the sandbag but you can also use other things that make it heavier or um, the weight should be appropriate for your child's ability so I put it like so in and also I put different things that are kind of of interest to a child like a ball for instance or the cones can you pass me the cones? We're gonna put them inside. Like there, think that your child likes to play. Yeah, I'll put it in. Put it in. Okay, and also uh, we will use something that will protect our floor or whatever material uh, kind of floor you have. So there, our bucket slides on the floor uh, easily. Okay, so now we're gonna move it to the one side of the room, guys. Let's move it to this side. Okay, and we're gonna come to another side of the room. Okay, why? I'm gonna show you. And now we're gonna pull, right? Oh, let me show you first, okay? And now we're gonna pull the weight that is there. Okay, let me first, let me first show you. Look, and I'm pulling it. Yeah, 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 good job, good job. Let me first finish, okay. Okay, and I'm gonna push it back. And remember to take your turns. Yes, I'm here. Okay, so your turn, and what we do also cheer for a person who is pulling the rope, okay? You ready, Johnny? Okay. Go Johnny, go! 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 Good job! Very good! Okay! Yes, go get ready for your turn! Okay, now we're gonna put it back and go all the way to the, here, here, all the way to the side of the wall, here, and, ready, okay, go Dima, go, 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 come on Johnny, clap for him, go Dima, go, Dima, go, go Dima, go, pull it, go Dima, go, Good job! Yeah, go, 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 go,
Okay, so over time you can increase the weight that child, your child is pulling and you also can increase the distance from where the child is pulling the rope, right? So this exercise is very good for strengthening your hands and it's also good for your for attention span, okay? Okay, let's move to another exercise and it's going to be squats. Okay guys, let's move it. Okay. So, for the squats, I'm usually using, if it's more than one person, uh, I can use the hula hoop. Nine, up, ten, up, eleven, eleven, twelve, up, twelve, fourteen, and fifteen, good job. Let's, let's do it and then okay come to a hold to the hoop okay come hold hold to it and we're gonna squat down one up two down 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 all the way down two up three down up four up we're gonna do ten times okay guys five